West Bengal has the sixth largest economy in India with 10.49 lakh rupees crore $150 billion. It is primarily dependent on agriculture and medium-sized industry, although services and heavy industries play an increasingly significant role in the economy of the state. Years after independence, West Bengal was still dependent on the central government for meeting its demands for food as production remained stagnant and the Green Revolution bypassed the state. However, there has been a significant spurt in food production since the 1980s. The state is now one of the few with a surplus, producing nearly 20% of the rice and 33% of the potato yield in 2004, despite accounting for only 7.55% of the population of India. The state's total financial debt stood at 1,918 billion rupees $27 billion as of 2011. Agriculture and livestock Topic. Agriculture accounts for the largest share of the labor force. It contributed around 18.7% to the gross state domestic product GSDP in 2009-10. A plurality of the state's population are peasant farmers. Rice and potato are considered to be the principal food crops of West Bengal. West Bengal is the largest producer of rice in India with an Annual output of around 16.1 million tonnes in FY 2015-16, and the second largest producer of potatoes in India with an average annual output of 11 million tonnes in FY 15. Rice, potato, jute, sugarcane and wheat are the top five crops of the state. Other major food crops include maize, pulses, oil seeds, wheat, barley, and vegetables. The state supplies nearly 90% of the potato requirement and 66% of the jute requirements of India. Tea is another important cash crop. Darjeeling is globally recognized for tea plantation of the acclaimed Darjeeling tea variety. Given below is a table of 2015 national output share of select agricultural crops and allied segments in West Bengal based on 2011 prices. West Bengal, the second largest tea producing state in India, produced 329.3 million kilograms of tea in 2014-15, accounting for 27.8% of the country's total tea production. In 2015-16, West Bengal produced approximately 2.38 mt of sugarcane and 3.1 mt of fruits. The state is the largest vegetables producing state in India with 25,466.8 thousand mt of production in 2012-13. West Bengal is one of the largest fish producing states in India. West Bengal accounts for nearly 10% of the country's edible oil production. The state produced a total of 1.63 million tons of fish in 2015-16 compared to a production of 1.61 million tons during 2014-15, retaining second spot after Andhra Pradesh in fish production. West Bengal produced around 4,961,000 tons of milk in FY 14-15. The state is the third largest meat producing state in the country including poultry after Uttar Pradesh and Andhra Pradesh, producing 0.648 million tons of meat in 2012-13 and it is the largest producer of goat meat. Industry State industries are mostly localized in the Kolkata region, the mineral-rich Western Highlands, and Haldia Port region. There are up to 10,000 registered factories in the state and the West Bengal state government has opened Shilpa Sathi, a single window agency in order to provide investors with all kinds of assistance in establishing and running industrial units. Kolkata is noted as one of the major centers for industries including the jute industry. There are numerous steel plants in the state apart from the alloy steel plant at Durgapur. The center has established a number of industries in the areas of tea, sugar, chemicals and fertilizers. Natural resources like tea and jute in and nearby parts have made West Bengal a major center for the jute and tea industries. West Bengal is at the forefront of leather processing and leather goods manufacturing and has around 666 units producing leather and leather related goods. Currently, 22-25% of India's tanning activity is undertaken in Kolkata and its suburbs. 
The state's share of total industrial output in India was 9.8% in 1980–81, declining to 5% by 1997–98. However, the service sector has grown at a rate higher than the national rate. Infrastructure Power and energy As of end of May 2016, according to data released by Central Electricity Authority on its site c.nic.in, the installed power capacity of the state is 9,984.4 MW, compared to 303.083 GW of the country. Of the total installed power capacity, 8,523.83 MW was contributed by thermal power, 1,328.3 MW was contributed by hydro power and renewable power together. West Bengal Government's Ministry of Power, in its report, enumerates individual power generating stations in West Bengal along with their respective locations and generating capacities while mentioning the total installed capacity as 13,826 MW as of March 2015. As of end of April 2016, 37,449 out of 37,463 villages, i.e. 99.96 care of of inhabited villages in West Bengal were cumulatively electrified. Topic: <laughs> Communication and transportation. Topic. As of 2011, West Bengal has a total road length of 92,023 kilometers, 57,180 miles, with a road density of 1.04 kilometers per square kilometer. Of this, national highways constitute 2,578 kilometers, 1,602 miles, and state highways 2,393 kilometers, 1,487 miles. As of June 2015, the central government mulled augmenting the state's national highways length by another couple of thousand kilometers in a bid to supplement to India's plan of seamless BBIN connectivity through Nepal, Bhutan, India and Bangladesh, subject to availability of land, by investing in the tunes of $4-5 billion. Railways <inaudible> 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 The Eastern Railways Zone, Southeastern Railways Zone and NF Railways Zone of Indian Railways run operations in West Bengal. At the end of 2014-15, the route length in West Bengal was 4,070 km of which around 4,000 km has been converted to broad gauge and around 2,500 km has been electrified. The running track length was 7,122 km and the total track length was 10,466 km, with the number of stations exceeding 800. Kolkata Metro Railway is the newest zone of the IR with a single operational link of 27 km route length, 17 km of which runs underground. As of 2016, various other metro links of approximately 120 km route length are underway in different phases of construction in Kolkata. Ports <laughs> 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 Kolkata is a major river port in eastern India. The Kolkata Port Trust manages both the Kolkata docks and the Haldia docks. There is passenger service to Port Blair on the Andaman and Nicobar Islands and cargo ship service to ports in India and abroad, operated by the Shipping Corporation of India. Kolkata Port handled 50.195 million tonnes of traffic in 2015-16, around 8.43% higher vis-a-vis -vis that handled during previous fiscal. Kolkata Dock System, the first major dock formally commissioned in 1870, handled cargo traffic of 16.688 MT in 2015-16, registering a significant growth of 9.2% over the previous year. Haldia Dock Complex, the first green port of the country in 2015, handled 33.507 MT in 2015-16, recording growth of 8.05% over the last year. In container traffic also, COPT recorded 6, 62,891 TEUs in 2015-16, clocking upwards of 5% growth over last year, and retained its third rank amongst major container handling ports in the country. 
KDS also achieved the highest ever container throughput of 5,77,749 TEUs in 2015–16, a significant growth of 9.39% over the last year. Kolkata Dock System handled a traffic of 12.540 million tons in 2010–2011 as against 13.045 million tons in 2009–2010. At Haldia Dock Complex, 35.005 million tons of traffic was handled in 2010-2011 as against 33.378 million tons in 2009-2010 implying an increase of 4.87%. <inaudible> Inland waterways the 560 km long Haldia Faraka stretch in West Bengal is part of the stretch of Ganges between Haldia and Allahabad declared as the National Waterway NW1. Also a 91 km long stretch of the NW5 is within West Bengal. West Bengal government has sought to build infrastructure to begin sustained fuel efficient cost efficient and eco-friendly shipping operations for cargo transportation and tourism, passenger traffic as well along 12 rivers in West Bengal which can reduce congestion on roads. These rivers that has been identified for national waterways services, are the Allahabad Haldia stretch of the Ganga Bhagirathi Hooghly River, Ajoy River 96 km, Bakreswar Myrikshi River 110 km, Damodar River 135 km, DVC Canal 130 km, Dwarakswar River 113 km, Ikchamati River 634 km, Jalangi River 131 km, Rupnarayan River 72 km, Subarnarika River 314 km and Sundarban waterways 201 km Topic Telecommunications Topic as of end of April 2016, as per statistics published in press release of TRI, there were 74.58 million wireless mobile phone subscriptions including 25.04 million with 90.43 Kara VLR or active connections in Kolkata service area and 49.54 million with 93.69% VLR or active connections in rest of West Bengal service area compared to over 1,034.25 million wireless less connections in the whole country with VLR or active connections of 90.31% and 1.275 million wireline subscriptions including 0.909 million in Kolkata and 0.365 million in rest of West Bengal in West Bengal with a total state level tele density of percent as of the 30th of April 2016 compared to over 25.036 million wireline connections in the whole country with nationwide total tele density of 83 3.32% while as of April end, 2016 the number of broadband subscriptions in the state were arbitrarily estimated to be around 11 million compared to that of whole of India with over 151.09 million broadband connections. VSNL has its International Gateway and Earth Station in Kolkata. International connectivity is provided through VSNL and 5 STPI Software Technology Parks of India Earth stations in Kolkata, Durgapur, Karagpur, Haldia and Siliguri. Diga has been selected as the cable landing station for the submarine cable laying project connecting India and South East Asia. BSNL has an optical fiber network of 15,000 km route in West Bengal. Reliance Group's Geo Infocom has laid 4,500 km of optical fiber network in the state for its 4G network. Under National Optic Fiber Network mission, optical fiber cable will be laid in 341 blocks covering most of the Gram Panchayats in West Bengal. Aviation <inaudible> 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 Spread over 2,640 acres at Dumdum -Dum in Kolkata, the largest in eastern India, the newly modernized Nataji Subhas Chandra Bose International Airport is the fifth busiest international airport in India in respect of aircraft movement after Delhi, Mumbai, Bangalore and Chennai. It has two asphalt runways, the primary one extended by 700 meters, 3627 times 50 meters, and upgraded to CATIIIB, and the secondary one, 2790 times 46 meters, upgraded to CATIIILS standards. 
Its terminal is a new and sprawling L-shaped six-level integrated terminal of over 2,510,000 square feet inaugurated in 2013, able to handle 25 million passengers per annum. It includes check-in counters that use Qt common user terminal equipment technology, 78 immigration counters, 12 customs counters, passenger lounges provided by Air India and Jet Airways, 18 aerobridges, 57 remote parking bays, two underground two-leveled car parks and car parking facilities in landscaped area capable of handling 5,000 cars. The airport has a center for perishable commodities CPC, two luxury hotels and a shopping mall. In the fiscal year April 2015 to March 2016, the airport handled 76,722 aircraft movements including 14,564 international aircraft movements, 12.42 million passengers including 2.22 million international passengers and 10.2 million domestic passengers, 105,390 tons of freight including 37,623 tons international freight. Between the 1940s and 1960s, major airlines such as Aeroflot, Air France, Alitalia, Cathay Pacific, Japan Airlines, Philippine Airlines, KLM, Pan Am, Lufthansa, Swissair and SAS operated from the airport. With the advent of longer-haul aircraft and the socio-economio-political degeneration of the state during the 1960s, several airlines gradually discontinued operations there. The withdrawal of Lufthansa's service to Frankfurt in 2012 left Kolkata with no direct flights beyond Asia. Kolkata Airport is to undergo the execution of Phase 2 of the expansion plan which primarily involves the construction of an 86-meter ATC tower. Additionally, the current Kolkata Metro expansion plans include two new lines to the airport for better connectivity. Bagdagra Airport near Siliguri is another significant airport in the state. Kazi Nasrul Islam Airport, country's first private greenfield Aerotropolis project spread over 650 acres, under Bengal Aerotropolis Projects Limited co-owned by Singapore-based Chani Group, conceived in 2006-07 to be a domestic, international airport with handling capacity of 1 million per annum that can be expanded to 2.5 million per annum in future, officially commenced operations in 2015 at Andal, 185 kilometers away from the state capital Kolkata. As of June 2016, the fledgling project is still suffering from birth pangs as it strives to attract airliners, grappling with dire paucity of adequate number of flyers necessary to sustain flying operations from here, in the investment-starved ambience prevailing in its immediate hinterland. Industry as of 2011, the state has 22 formally approved special economic zones says. Of these, 17 are related to information technology IT or IT, enabled services ITES. Topic: Economic indices. Topic: as per the state budget presented in the State Legislative Assembly on June 24, 2016, West Bengal's nominal GSDP at current prices has risen to 9.20083 trillion Indian rupees or $140.68 billion in the year 2015 16, the average INR to US dollar exchange rate in that year being 65 Indian rupees and 40 paise. West Bengal S average population in that year being 95.5 million, per capita nominal GSDP at current prices for the economic year 2015-16 can be calculated as $1,473. In terms of nominal net state domestic product NSDP at factor cost at current prices base year 2004-2005, West Bengal was the sixth largest economy in India, with an NSDP of 7,289.74 billion Indian rupees or $120.93 billion in 2014-15 and in terms of nominal gross state domestic product GSDP at current prices, the state had GSDP of $132.86 billion in the economic year 2014-15 as mentioned by India Brand Equity Foundation. India 
S purchasing power parity conversion factor and US dollar to INR exchange rate in 2014-15 being 16.98 and 61 Indian rupees and 11 paise respectively West Bengal SGSDP PPP at market prices in 2014-15 can be calculated as international 478.16 billion dollars for 2014-15 in the period 2004-2005 to 2009-2010, the average gross state domestic product (GSDP) growth rate was 13.9%, calculated in Indian rupee term, lower than 15.5%, the average for all states of the country. The state's nominal per capita NSDP at factor cost at current prices base year 2004-05 was 78,903 Indian rupees or $1,291 in 2014-15, average dollar exchange rate being 61 Indian rupees and 11 paise that economic year, improved from $553.70 in 2004-05, but lower than the national nominal per capita NDP at current prices base year 2012-15. 13 of 102839 Indian rupees and 47 paise or $1683 INR to US dollar exchange rate in 2014-15 being 61 Indian rupees and 11 paise in 2014-15 West Bengal's nominal per capita GSDP at current prices in 2014-15 was $1,412, the state's estimated average population over 2014-15 being around 94.3 millions. In 2009-10, the tertiary sector of the economy service industries was the largest contributor to the gross domestic product of the state, contributing 57.8% of the state domestic product compared to 24% from primary sector agriculture, forestry, mining and 18.2% from secondary sector industrial and manufacturing. At a compound annual growth rate of 15.2%, the tertiary sector has been the fastest growing among the three sectors from 2004-05 to 2009-10. The growth has been driven by trade, hotels, real estate, finance, insurance, transport, communications and other services. The state's total financial debt that stood at 1918 billion rupees, 27 billion dollars as of 2011 swelled to 3050 billion rupees, 42 billion dollars at the end of 2015-16 and is estimated to further grow to 3340 billion rupees, 47 billion dollars at the end of 2016-17. Topic district wise economic indicators topic The following is a list of basic economic data for the districts of West Bengal as of 2013 2014, the latest year for which data is available. Topic foreign direct investment topic Under the overall guidance and policies of the Government of India, the West Bengal Government welcomes foreign technology and investments as may be appropriate for the needs of the state and is mutually advantageous. Foreign direct investment has mostly come in the manufacturing and telecommunication sectors. According to the Department of Industrial Policy and Promotion, Government of India, the cumulative FDI inflow in Kolkata Reserve Bank region comprising West Bengal, Sikkim, Andaman and Nicobar Islands from April 2000 to September 2016 amounted to $3,967 million. Kolkata Reserve Bank region was seventh among the reserve bank regions of the country in terms of amount of cumulative FDI, behind Mumbai, New Delhi, Bangalore, Ahmedabad, Chennai and Hyderabad regions. Topic exports Topic West Bengal is one of the country's leading exporters of finished leather goods. In 2009-10, the state accounted for around 13.5% of the country's exports of leather and leather products. The state accounted for around 70% of India's dried flour exports in 2008-09. The state is also a leading exporter of shrimps and tea. However, the rapid industrialization process has given rise to debate over land acquisition for industry in this agrarian state. NASCOM Gartner ranks West Bengal power infrastructure the best in the country. Topic further reading Topic Ball, R. Sadi, G. and Wallace, S. 2009. West Bengal, Fiscal Decentralization to Rural Governments, Analysis and Reform Options No. Paper 0907. International Center for Public Policy, Andrew Young School of Policy Studies, Georgia State University. References Topic. 
Topic. External links Topic. Finance Department, Government of West Bengal